Uh, here's my object that I chose. It's a book. It's an old atlas, actually. Good morning. My name is Andrew Adleon. You may know me. I'm from Tish. I graduated here last year, and I want to speak to you about various life objects. Okay. Um, a book. A book is a treasure trove for knowledge and imagination, waiting to be delved into by the human soul. And it can take many forms. A book can be joyous, sad, it can be happy, depressing. On the outside, it can be brand new. This library has some brand new books. Or it can, on the outside, it can be kind of old, scrubbed up, like this one. And uh, a lot of people, in case you don't know it, or I guess in my viewpoint, a lot of people are kind of like books. Because books, for one thing, they have various emotions. Books can be a comedy, they can be funny, they can be sad, some kind of tragedy of some sort. Uh, like human beings, we all experience various emotions, happiness, sadness. For me, I'm generally a happy person. Very rarely do I venture into the sad spectrum. Uh, but I do experience the more negative emotions. Just a couple weeks ago, when I uh, went to Sonic, I asked for a job at Chiller, and they said that the ice cream machine was broken. I cried more than other men should, because it was 100 degrees outside. Celsius, that's when the water boils. It's way too hot for outside. Human beings should not live that long. And so, you know, I experienced some of the other emotions. Uh, second off, books can be nonfiction or fiction, uh, true or blatant lie. Kind of like a fairy tale compared to an atlas, because atlases should be wrong. They can get lost all the time. Um, about that fiction thing, we all tell lies. No one in here has not lied. If you do say so, you're lying right now. I, well, I'll admit, I lie all the time. I'll lie to get out of trouble. I'll lie just because. I will tell white lies, burgundy lies, blue lies, mahogany, all the colors of rainbows, fairest lies. But on the other hand, I will tell the truth, nothing but the truth, because I never stray from honesty. That was also a lie, but you cannot lie. And so we all of them here lie, just like books. They can be fact or fiction. Well, last of all, books must have a story. And each of us here, we have our own story, because all the memories, all the experiences, all the people we've met, know the who we are. But if each year of your life is a chapter, I'd say I'm on my 18th chapter. And so far, the protagonist who has taken all my speech class he just remembered that he doesn't like to give speeches because you have to do work and prepare for stuff. Determination, all these responsibilities. Not my thing. Or the protagonist's thing. Though, in the 21st year of the protagonist's life, I believe he'll go skydiving. Maybe. His mom knows him. <laughs> Maybe. I'm not sure. But uh, I'm hoping trying to see the connection I'm trying to make between people in the book. Or myself in the book, at least. Because each of us here, we have our own story. And it's a few to tell it. Freedom!